everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today I am very, very, very excited. Um, I'm actually a bit embarrassed because over the past few weeks I have been building up a bit of a collection of new clothes and now looking at it next to me here, it is a bit too much. I'm not gonna lie, this is not okay. I was looking up all the prices and stuff and I was like, oh, okay. So let's get in. So this is like mainly, um like summer stuff things i've been wearing around the house some of it's a bit more like dressy things because you know we've got to be ready for when all this is over so i've kind of just been like building up different bits and actually starting to get a bit of a summer wardrobe together because this is the first year i've ever been able to do that because i'm normally just like whipping my money around but i've got nothing else to spend it on so let's go so the first item i'm going to start off with is actually the most boring i would say but i do agree and believe in buying the essentials first like the staple things and then building on top of that really believe in buying the essentials first like the staple items your jeans your denim shorts your white hoodie your joggers first and then building on that because otherwise you're gonna have like loads of nice little bits and you're not gonna know how to bring them together so that brings me to the first item so i bought these quite a few weeks ago and it is simply just a pair of denim jeans straight leg as you can see and you've probably seen me wear these in videos i actually styled them in the reimagining my wardrobe they featured in that um once or twice and I have always worn mom jeans like them they've been my favorite but I wanted to try something different and actually this straight jean has really like opened up a new wardrobe set to me and I really love them with absolutely anything this top little crop top and a cardigan just a cardigan an oversized jumper you can wear it with a hood I don't really wear it with a hoodie you could wear it with a hoodie um oversized jumper big white t-shirt any color t-shirt so I whack these on every other day to go out for my walk in to feel a bit sassy in jeans. But I would definitely recommend, so these are Topshop jeans, so you know it's coming, they are expensive. Um, so these were £40, obviously I got a student discount which took it down to about 30, £36, well yeah. If it was £40 you get 10% off, 10% of 40 is £4, yeah £36. So these were £36 for me. Very expensive, I know, sorry, but I love the colour, I love the light, so it's like very um, in summer, like it's the summer vibe light jeans, because in winter you're more in like black jeans, dark denim, but this, these are like really light and lovely with a white trainer, clear heel, they're just going to go with everything, dress them up or down, you know, they're just jeans, but I haven't worn a straight jean ever, so this is the first time of me wearing them, I have got quite short legs, and they still work, I thought because I'm, I'm quite curvy and a bit crazy um with tiny legs but thoroughly enjoying these so i would recommend as a staple as i said i know they're expense but it's just it just has to be done sometimes so next i'm gonna go in with another kind of like casual one that you've probably seen in a few of the videos already but it is um these joggers now these are from asos asos whatever you call as you can see <laughs> they are bright so not really in like the pastel vibe but um, really comfy on the inside they are nylon so I did try and tie dye these if you watched um, the vlog one of the vlogs I tried to dye, tie dye them and it didn't work but that's okay it was just because I, I fancied tie dyeing something but I do love them I throw these on with white t-shirt white hoodie um, just super comfy so and you know that if you get bleach on them they're not gonna stain because as you can see there's not one drop of stain or bleach on them super comfy I throw these on most nights just to chill out after because I normally like I like go for my shower I'll go down like go for my shower get into these chill downstairs have tea blah 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 so I will jump into these first these are 22 pounds which is not bad I think that's pretty good for a pair of joggers um also you get shooting discount on ASOS ASOS um got them in a size 8 which is true to size absolutely perfect and super comfy soft on the inside why not? Just a bit of fun rather than like your boring grey, which I have. I just thought they're a bit funky and fun. And then just as a little quick thing as well, I do have the matching little top for it. Now, as you can see, it's very like cut in. So when I didn't wear it without a bra, it kind of made my boobs like, like jump out to the sides. And it does look like you're wearing it on backwards. 
um, but it's still cute, it's something different if you're into it, um, but it's only £8, I got it in a size 8 which is fine, it does hold things, I could try and wear, I don't really have any um, balcony bras or what they're called, strapless bras, but it would work with one of them, but it's just a lovely little set, something a bit fun and bright, because obviously everything's quite pastel, I just thought that was quite fun, but would def definitely recommend, um, staying true to size with both the joggers and the top. Well, next we are going to move on to some cardigans. Now, disclaimer, I can't actually find one of them on the website anymore. So I'm going to try and link something similar. I don't know why. Why do they do that? It's so annoying. Like, just keep it on and say it's out of stock. But um, I've got this one on, but you've seen this for a while. It's just from, uh, is it Pretty Little Thing or Misguided? This is from Pretty Little Thing, size small. Um, but I'm not talking about this one because I don't have ages. But I've got another two, and these two are from Nasty Gal. So here's the first one, and it is this like really low scoop neck blue cardigan, and it's got um, really long sleeves with a bit of like a flare on the end. Super cute, um, just as a top on its own. Like I love to wear this just buttoned up. You get a sassy little bit of cleavage, which is cute. Um, but I um, would 100% recommend this. I think it's super cute for like these like spring days when it's like a bit windy but it's warm. Um, keeps you nice and warm. Cute. Love the colour. Loving the pastel vibes if you haven't already noticed. But super love. This is £28 apparently. But I don't think I paid £28 for it. On Nasty Girl. I got this in a size. Oh so I got it in a 10. And that's kind of. I think I'd probably stay true to size because it is a, a little bit like baggy here like it does drop a bit it could have been done with being a bit smaller so I would stay true to size there is also I've seen on the website at the moment that there is a sale on and it's £14 because I don't think I paid £28 for this but it's like really nice thick material lovely for a spring day pastel vibes would look great with the jeans super cute 100% recommend now the next one is this yellow v-neck also from Nasty Gal and I don't seem to be able to find it on the site and I don't know why. But I love this kind of yellow spring chick look. I also got it in a size medium. So I think I was thinking like oversized baggy. It's also cropped. So this is, the other one's like a swoop neck and this one's like a eh, kind of swooped as well. But this one's a definite V neck. I've been wearing this on its own with a nice little white vest underneath. Um, another one just to chuck on, that with the blue jeans. Again, you've got it. Can't find, I honestly couldn't tell you how much this is or whatever, but I'll try and find something similar. Have a look on like PLT Misguided and just type in like yellow cardigan. I'm sure something will come up. But I just thought like, so I have now have three cardigans all in different colours just to kind of match whatever vibe I'm going for really. I, I was going to get a pink, but I have way too many pink items in my, in my wardrobe and I don't need to add to that. So I thought I'd try and be different, get some funky colours. So I hope you feel inspired to do that as well. And I find with the cardigans, like they're really easy to style. Like it's something you can just chuck on with a pair of jeans, denim shorts, cycling shorts, literally anything. And you, you're gonna look a bit more dressed up because they're a lovely like pastel -y color. It just looks really nice. Moving on next, should we do t-shirts? Actually no, we'll do it. The next thing in this haul is these cute little Adidas pastel blue shorts I absolutely love these I've been wearing them all the time because I don't own any denim shorts at the moment and that is something I do need to get um cute waistband really pulls you in elasticated pastel blue cute little pocket on the back obviously you're not going to put anything in there what I like about these shorts is they are short but my bum isn't out like my whole bum is covered and like the tops of my thigh so they're like really flattering and your bum's not hanging out because I have a problem with that in shorts. Comfy because they're not denim. You've got the cute three stripes down the side. They did have these in a black as well but I was going to go for the black but I thought I've got black cycling shorts and I thought it's summer. Come on be a bit brave and you know what I'm 100% glad I went for these and invested in pastel blue because I think they're super cute. I got these in a size 8 so definitely stay true to size. They are absolutely fine on my booty. Really accentuate the waist and look great. These were £22, which is not that bad for Adidas. Like, I feel like you can pay that for a t-shirt and these are shorts. 
you know what I mean? That's like thicker material and stuff. Love these. I did get these from Urban Outfitters, but I can't find them on the site anymore, but I'm sure they'll be on something else. I'll have a look and try and link down below where you can find them. Um, but I'd keep looking on Urban Outfitters because they might have just took them off and then when they restock, put them back on. So I would honestly just keep looking because these are an investment. And if I had the money, I'd probably get them in black as well because I'd just, I'd wear these instead of denim shorts. Again, I would style them with white t-shirt, white vest, tank top, oversized t-shirt. If you've got any tie dye that's a bit blue and white, that would look nice. Literally anything, The one of the cardigans. I'd probably wear it with this cardigan, like blue and purple, literally anything. And they're great for just like sitting about in the garden as well, because obviously it's been quite hot recently. They're good to just throw on, because if you sweat, it's like, you can sweat in this kind of material, if you get what I mean. Anyways, I'll carry on. Okay, so next we're coming on to a lot of t-shirts because I always buy other things like a crop top, cardigan, and I don't actually have nice t-shirts to just throw on. So I have bought just that. So let's start with these three, four. So we'll start with this one. So these are from, this is from ASOS, ASOS, whatever you want to call it, and it is this blue t-shirt um pastel blue and it says sunday on it three times super cute just literally a plain t-shirt love it um i'll be wearing this with my gray joggers with the blue shorts if you want a full blue outfit jeans anything it's it's just a beautiful t-shirt goes in with the vibe for summer of this pastel look so this was actually um 10 pounds on sale down from 14 pounds but even 14 pounds isn't that bad for a t-shirt i don't think but i paid 10 pounds for this and i thought you know what for 10 pounds to add a bit of color I, I don't think before this i owned i think all my clothes were either white t-shirts had two nude ones and pink so i had to like add more colors in so thoroughly enjoy 10 pounds from asos i got this in a size medium and i'm glad i did because it's it's actually quite tight i, I think i wanted the t-shirts quite like oversized and baggy to just like slouch around in with like joggers shorts um but it's actually still quite fit it's not fitted but it's not as big as i wanted it so if you want it quite baggy i would go large but if you want it tight maybe stay true to size i just went medium but it's still not like you won't look at it like that's meant to be baggy it's just like a little bit baggy but yeah super nice the next one is also from asos asos um and i didn't actually i just wanted some graphic tees i didn't actually realize what it said on it but here it is it's this off-white t-shirt and it actually says Rith rhythm is a and then it has a picture of ballet shoes so it's meant to be rhythm is a dancer um which is not that cute <laughs> like if i saw it in a shop i'd be like oh i'm not gonna wear that but you can't tell what it says from far away and i just like the highlights of the baby blue again so obviously i could wear this with um the adidas shorts jeans you name it the you know the little skirts from the first haul i did it was the uni staples i had two skirts still wearing them because they are staples and i wear the velvet skirt with this just a black one just to dress it up a little bit, but I absolutely love it. I wanted to get some like graphic tees and this is also from ASOS. I also got this in a medium, but again, it's not like huge. I, I probably should have got large, but I just, I was a bit nervous. So I'd say stay true to size if you want it to be like just a normal fitted t-shirt, but definitely size up once or twice if you want it a bit oversized. The medium's fine on me. I actually wore this in a vlog recently and it's it's like baggy the sleeves are like mid-length they kind of like come to here so you could roll them up if you wanted if you didn't want them that long um this was 27 pounds again i don't think i paid that i think i got discount but it is a super cute top again it's a white t-shirt you can style it with anything like literally like i said the scott jeans the adidas blue shorts if you had the shorts in black um cycling shorts it's great for just like chucking on in the garden going for your walking if you just want to feel a bit nicer than grubby old clothes it's a lovely purchase and the next t-shirt is this pink i know i said i had pink but it's a different shade okay it's this pink graphic tee also from asos asos um 
and this is actually men's it was in the men's section and i actually saw it um advertised on a, uh, an instagrammer that i absolutely love she's called jilly is it jilly bell she's beautiful like the style icon of the century she's beautiful and i'm sure she put this on and i've actually bought this in a size large it's a large men's so i can wear it as an oversized dress and i thought that's really cute to like go on your walk in slouch around the house you could stick on the blue shorts underneath just to like just for protection and support what does it say on it protected by nature that's a bit cringe again didn't read it just thought it was cute and this was actually only 12.99 for a dress that's a t-shirt dress that's pretty good love the color stick on a white trainer cute little tie-dye sock little bag ready for your walk put your hair up in a little bun at the back or like a scrape back pony and little fat oh will you have seen you might have seen i think oh i don't no 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 this is going out on wednesday so a little sneak peek i'm actually gonna wear this i think on my birthday and style it up because i didn't want to buy like a full expensive outfit to sit in my house so i'm actually gonna be wearing this for my 21st as a little thing but i'm gonna style it up with something that you'll see later in the video but comfy casual savage <laughs> nasty bougie wretched <laughs> Oh, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, ASOS, men's large, comfy, casual, wretched. Three more t-shirts. Well, two t-shirts. So the next thing we have again is a sauce. And it is this baby yellow Levi's t-shirt. Now this is the softest, cutest thing. When this arrived, I was like, yes, this is the one here's the little like logo that's on it so it says levi's california and that's kind of like a neon pink oh, i could wear these with the neon joggers that'd be cool gray joggers white joggers oh it's just lovely with purple i'm enjoying like purple and yellow or the blue cardigan over it um so this was because it is levi's it's 25 pounds discount with discount on asos not that bad but it's still keeping with that like um summer vibe very pastel i got this in a medium and i'm glad i did it's just a bit more oversized so it's a bit more casual it's so comfy soft a great investment i think that's another t-shirt anything jeans the skirt that i speak about the skirt gray white joggers i'm gonna wear them with them pink joggers that could look really cool because obviously that's neon as well it's quite neon-y if you can see yeah a great investment. I, I love this t-shirt. I'm really loving the yellow. Like, I don't think yellow was ever in my wardrobe until now, and now I'm absolutely loving it. I think it's just like a really brightening colour. I love it. Okay, final kind of t-shirt is this crazy tie-dye t-shirt from Urban Outfitters. And this was how much was it, Emma? 31 pounds i think it's 35 pounds and i got a discount eek not cheap but very in the vibe at the moment easy to wear because obviously there's so many colors in it literally any color you can wear it with green you can wear it with yellow you can wear it with blue you can wear it with um pink literally anything cute little skirt gray joggers you can go blue jeans you can go adidas shorts you can go denim shorts anything because it's so colorful literally anything i actually have some um yellow pants that um, match this top it, this is actually all poly and i have the wide leg yellow pants and i wore the, the yellow pants and this as an outfit and it just brought out that yellow bit and it's so cute um i did get this in a small to medium so it's still like quite big i think if you got the medium to large it'd be a t-shirt dress so this is like baggy enough that it can still be a t-shirt but you can actually wear it with just some like little shorts and it'll be quite long so really enjoying the colors i just think it's so fun and fresh okay so the next thing i've got is also from urban outfitters and it is this cute little green zip up i absolutely love this um 
I don't know if you remember, but I actually have this in white as well. It's this like super soft material, really stretchy. And this one, I think the white one has a, like a half zip, but this actually zips down the full way. Don't know why that needs to be necessary, but it does do that. So if, if you got too hot, unzip, I don't know. Um, I actually got this, the, the, the other one I got in a medium because I was a bit nervous about my boobs. But this one I actually got in a small and it's still fits. Like it's one of them ones that just stretches to your body. So I think you're fine to stay true to size. Um, love the colour. Is that like pastel -y green colour? Because I don't have any like pastel green. So I've got this and now like a bit of the green in the tie-dye top. Super comfy casual. Um, what do I wear it with? Probably just like blue jeans. Um, the Scott would look cool. That would be like a little posh outfit. Um, Grey joggers, white joggers, tie-dye joggers, you name it. Oh, I just love the pastel vibe. I'm so glad this is a thing. I actually paid, well, I didn't pay for it because this is actually a early birthday gift from James. But this is £24, which you get student discount, so that's better. And I think we got it in the sale. There was a little sale on, so yeah, I'd really look out for um, sales because I think we paid about £12 for this. It was definitely not £24. Um, stay true to size, but I think it's just a lovely thing to throw on. Beautiful colour, lovely, soft, stretchy material, ready to go on your walk a day if you go on one. I would stick this on. Super cute, dress it up, dressing it down. It's one of the things that you can dress up and down. But yeah, would definitely recommend. So the last kind of clothing item of this haul is a little bit different. I'm a bit nervous about it, but it is another EX Franz and it is this zip up bright pink. It's not bright pink, it's like baby pink, like bubblegum pink zip up, full zip up. I haven't had a full zip up since probably school. Zip ups scare me. They do scare me because I, th I think they can be quite hard to style, but I think this with the jeans and a cute little like pink trainer or white trainer could look cute. Very much like just slouchy vibes if you have like a little pair of shorts on, little white t-shirt or tie-dye t-shirt and this over the top. Um, this is a size small and it's quite big, like it's quite nicely oversized. So I'd definitely say it's true size if you want it like a little bit baggy, I don't know. And it comes with this cute little contrast pink and you know I'm a sucker for that. It's definitely like a bubble gum pink colour and I love it. It's just a cute little like jacket, it's got a hood, it's got the toggle things. I think this was expensive. How much was it? So this was apparently £46. I don't think I paid that either. I think I think I'm getting a lot of like discounts and things. Because I don't remember paying £46 for this. But um, one thing I do have to say about it is, is it did come bobbly. Let me try and let it focus. I don't know if you can see, but there is like tiny bobbles on it. And I, I opened it and I was a bit like, oh, why is that bobbly? But I'm, I'm kind of over it now. There's, there's a, but I think it might be like a part of the design. Maybe that's like edgy. I don't, I don't know. Again, this is Urban Outfitters. £46, but you will get discount. Lovely pink colour, all white under, oh imagine white joggers, white top or some tie dye and this you can wear it with, I think jeans would be, jeans are a bit risky but straight jean, bright like light blue like I've got, um, could look cute. Um, just to throw on in the house if you get a bit cold, like I've been loving to just throw it on rather than a hoodie and like dropping it all down your white hoodie. It's nice to just have a bit of colour as well but love that. Um, next, I'll do a little one. Um, these are from ASOS and they are just a pair of gold hoops. You'll have seen me wearing these in a few videos now, a few vlogs, and I wore it in the baking video. Um, and it's just a different kind of gold hoop. Nice and small, nice and thick. These are from ASOS, £16, which is, it's not cheap, but it's not expensive either because obviously it's not real gold. Um, but I just think they're a cute little gold hoop to stick on in your walk, show your neighbours that you're still working it in quarantine, like you haven't stopped and they'll look great when we're back to normal. Just a lovely little hoop. They're a bit more like gold, like yellow gold, but I've been wearing these all the time and I really love them. Just to kind of like change up your ear a little bit, just to feel fancy. £16, ASOS, love. 
Okay, shall I move on to my favourite thing? Right, it's the favourite thing of the haul. This is from Topshop. Unfortunately, it's not available at the moment, but I have found different versions of it and keep an eye out because they might get them back in. But it is this knot bag. I love this. I take this on all my walks. I think it's super cute. Um, it's just this beautiful light pink. It's um, it's actually really big. Like you can fit so much in this. Like it's absolutely massive. I love the um, the standard top shop. You have like a little pocket in the back, so if you were going out, you could literally just stick your cards in that. Like. I know we're not going out, but if you like, you put your ID and your card, bank card in that. This fits my vlogging camera, my purse, my phone, a lipstick, a lifesaver, a power bank, you name it. it can, it's, it's actually massive and it just sits on the shoulder, under your arm, safest place to be, looks cute with any pastel outfit. I even imagine this with the pink jacket on, cute. Oh, honestly my favourite. Now this is from Topshop. It was £16, I want to say. £14, I think it was on sale for £14, so I think they're ranging from about, because we've got a few other colours, they're ranging from £14 to £16. I can't find the pink, but have a look out please, because they might get it back on. But I did have a look, and they do have it in black. And I just think, do I need to buy it? Because I just think having a black one as well would be so staple-like, especially, I don't want to say the word, but like when we go back into winter, this in black would be absolutely perfect. But that for summer, it just got like, even though I'm not wearing pink, the pastel vibes, it's just still there. Um, but I, I might even invest in the black, like now. Because I just think it's a beautiful design, so simple. Like, it can be a statement, or the black on it just be like, oh, but imagine like a white outfit in the black bag. <sighs> I'm gonna have to get it, I think. Okay, and next thing is more accessories. So the next thing is these little clips. Keeping with the pastel vibes. So we've got a purple, a yellow, a pink, and a blue. Just to put in the hair. Now the only thing is with these, I don't really know how to style them. Like, do you wear them like that? Because I just think I look a bit silly. Like, don't you do that? But to me, that just like that doesn't look cute on me, I don't think. I just think that looks just makes my head go a bit pie-shaped. But if you know you suit these clips, or like you just wear them like that, like just to scrape one side of that's cute. Maybe it needs to be lower down. Just like that. I think they're super cute to like fit in with the vibe. It's like tying everything together. The um, It's like starting to bring outfits together. So like if you're wearing purple and yellow, maybe I'd wear the purple and yellow in my hair or I could wear blue to contrast, like literally anything. I just think it's so fun to like play around with like different accessories to kind of match your outfit or contrast, whatever. But these were, so these were actually four pounds down from 12 pounds. So they should be 12 pounds, but I got them for four pounds. So um, super cute, just to like stick in the side of the hair. Really nice accessory to kind of like tie your outfits together if you don't really know how to do that. I would recommend these. Oh, I'll just put them away in my bag. Wow, so much room. <laughs> okay, and the next item is from Misguided. And I, you'll actually have seen me, you, if you watched a vlog, I think it was lockdown vlog week five, you'll have actually, um, Wednesday to Friday, you'll have seen me buy these in the car. And it is these pink chunky sunglasses. Now these are not for everyone, like you can't wear them just like this, like, oh yeah. Do you know what I mean? They're very much like style and posing and they're like really chunky. They say it on the website that they were lilac, but I knew straight away they were not lilac. Very much pink. Pink chunky sunglasses. So cute for the pastel vibes. Just to look cute, like walking past your neighbours on your walk. Like, hiya, mm, yeah. Ooh, looking good. Absolutely love these, I think. Even just on the head, they're just a cute accessory. Again, tying in everything. Very pastel summer vibes. I absolutely love these. Obviously, they're great to sit out in the garden in. I love, like, I'd wear them like this, but obviously that looks a bit silly. But they're great for, like, pics. And just another great accessory. These were £8.99, but they ended up being £10 with delivery. 
but that and they but they came next day misguided thank you for that can't believe the turnaround it was amazing it said like three to five days and you pay like your 299 but they actually came next day so i had them straight away and i think they're a very good purchase i think it's nice to like um because I've, I've got tortoise shell ones like this as well but it's nice to build up a bit of a collection and then like you can do what goes with an outfit kind of thing so the next item looking in front of me i think i've got a bit overboard um all from urban outfitters socks so these are all the is it it's franz um like let's let's franz kind of thing socks and they're just kind of like different colors i've actually been wearing these right now with the purple to match i've just been loving matching my socks to my outfits i just think it's a really fun way to tie an outfit together example i'm gonna wear the blue slogan t-shirt from asos it says sunday on it with the blue socks I'm gonna wear this cardigan with this. I'm gonna wear the pink with the pink. Like, I just think it's such an easy way to tie in your t-shirt to your socks and you look like you put together. I think it's a really fun way of um, experimenting with your outfits. And I think my personal fave are the tie-dye ones. I think these are a little bit more expensive as well. I think they were like a pound more or something. But obviously I've just been wearing these with like a really oversized white hoodie. And these you can wear them with the Adidas shorts, you can wear anything. I just think they're so cool. These are six pound a pair. They do have some kind of deals on and stuff. So I think they had like two for two for something price. So check out that. Um, but definitely investment like I'm not being funny, because they're like a brand and they're thick quality, they're going to last for a long time. Super soft, make your outfit look cute. Would just recommend just buying some colourful socks, but if you don't want to spend that much, I do have an alternative. So I have another set, and you get these three colours. These are from ASOS, and you get three colours. They're a cute little like frill on them, as you can tell, they've all been worn. Um, but these three come as a multi-pack and um, they're £10 for three. So if you don't want to spend like £6, that sounds ridiculous now I'm saying it, but if you don't want to spend like £6 on one pair, I'd suggest just getting the multi-pack and they're, they're like, these ones are like really bright colours. Um, obviously these are from Urban Outfitters, I don't know if I said. Um, example, I'd wear the green with the um, tie-dye top from Urban Outfitters because that has a nice green in. I'd also wear the green with the zip-up top Blue with the Sunday or the white slogan tee. Pink with white or pink with pink with the big oversized one. Perfect. Just to style up your outfit and you feel, I cannot tell you how put together you feel with your sock and your top matching. And then final thing for today, this is a bit more sassy, but it is my birthday coming up and I am planning on wearing these with, did I say you'll have seen? No, you won't. Um, I'm planning on wearing these with the pink oversized jack um, t-shirt and you're either gonna love them or hate them so hear me out it is these cowboy western boots Ooh. now I really struggled to find some that I liked because I didn't like the really bright white ones because I think they looked a bit like plasticky they still do but like they've got this kind of like croc print on them and they're a bit more like off-white cream than bright white so I thought that kind of like dulled them down a bit and um, I did want them like like mid calf kind of level but they've ended up being like at the knee because I'm quite small so I should have kind of factored that in. Um, these particular ones, you can get them on like, there was some on ASOS that went out of stock and I was so sad, um, but these particular ones are from Public Desire. It says on the website at the moment they're £44.99, but I actually only paid about £30 for them because they've got sales on all the time. I think literally at the moment they've got a 75% sale or like ridiculous sales, so I would definitely not buy them at full price. I would never pay that much for a pair of shoes. But it's something that you can wear with anything, any cute kind of little dress. I just think these would look so sweet with. Um, throw them up all over your jean, that could look quite cute. Maybe not for summer because that would be sweaty, but oversized t-shirt dress, any kind of little dress. Love these, but I shall be wearing these for my 21st with a pink oversized t-shirt, just as a quarantine look. Oh, one last thing. So as you know, we're all at home. Um, we're all spending a lot of time on our phones, laptops, TV, and I've been getting a lot of headaches, like especially doing uni work, editing, watching movies, 
playing sims everything seems to be on a screen so and i've been getting headaches so i thought it'd be good to invest in some blue lens glasses now i've had some before which you'll see in the older vlogs and they were from key is it called key australia it's spelled like q u a y i used to say quay but apparently it's key key australia and they cost 40 pounds i wasn't prepared to invest that much again so i just went on to amazon and bought a pair so i'll show you now um just type in blue lens glasses i'll put a link below on the ones that i've got but i literally just typed in blue lens glasses and basically if you, ever, if you haven't heard of these um what they do is it's kind of like you know when you put your phone onto night mode and um, it actually puts a yellow tone over your screen because the blue light that comes from your screen is actually harsh for your eyes so the blue lens actually blocks that and makes it a bit more yellowy so it comes in this little packet and i got the clear frame they do pink blue um gray black and this is what they look like Ooh. um so i've just been wearing these i think they look like quite cool they're quite fun to kind of just like you feel very intelligent like all of a sudden i feel like right let's get my work done I feel like very professional um i'll see if you can actually see the blue lens of it so i don't know if you can see i'm trying to like show you can you see how there's like a yellow tinge to it it doesn't show up great on camera but in real life you can really see it so it puts like a yellowy tinge to it like night mode and i think they're really super sassy um one advice i would give is um my friend Karis actually bought some a few weeks ago and she said make sure you're only wearing them on screen because then if you're wearing them all the time which you started doing um you then get headaches in reverse because obviously then your eyes aren't used to like normal light so you need to make sure that you get in natural light as well but definitely use these when looking at a screen it's gonna prevent getting headaches from looking at a screen for a long time so i would suggest buying these so other pair i bought from key australia obviously beautiful brand um great styles these are fine for me though guess how much 10 pounds 10 pounds people from amazon again said it was going to come like next week ended up coming two days after love i think they're quite stylish if you didn't have any makeup on just throw these on do your work and you feel a bit better about yourself while you're sending snapchats um they come with a little bag but would recommend because obviously we're all looking at screens a lot more at the moment i just thought i'd sneak that in there as a little as a little safety feature you know cute stylish but also great for your eyeballs really enjoyed um filming this so let me know if you want more hauls um but yeah yeah that is the end of the video stay safe and i'll see you soon with another vid bye